Now we're going to test our Microsoft Visual C++ 2005 Express Edition compiler, which is actually easier done than it's said. Here's all we need to do. After you install the Express Edition compiler, you click on Start, of course, All Programs, and then the Visual C++ Express Edition item. Now don't go right to the compiler. That brings up the IDE. We want to click on the Visual Studio Tools, then the command prompt, then we will type CL to run the compiler, and we'll confirm that it actually ran. Let's go over and do that. Here you see that we have clicked on Start and All Programs, and now we have to scroll down to Visual C++ 2005 Express Edition, over to Visual Studio Tools, and then we select the Visual Studio 2005 command prompt. That will bring up a normal command window, and you can see that we are in the program files Microsoft Visual Studio 8 VC. Now this command prompt has also had a number of environment variables set so that the compiler will function properly. If you go straight into a normal black command prompt and try to run the compiler, it most likely will not function properly. And what's worse, it may appear to function properly, but then not link properly and give you a lot of trouble. So only start the command line the way that I just showed you to start it. Otherwise, you'll have lots of additional problems on top of programming in the language. Now to test the compiler, it's simply CL, Enter, and we see that the Microsoft 32-bit C and C++ optimizing compiler for X, ADX86 is actually running. And it also gives us a usage line that we would type in CL and any kind of options that we might want to compile, which we won't re really be working with that. The file name that we're going to compile and then any kind of link options after the slash link identifier. So pretty simple and we have a working C compiler. Just of course type exit to get out of this and that's what we needed to do. Next we're going to go on and take a look at putting a C compiler on a Linux system which is about the same process but we'll take a look at that next.